Hello, originally I meant to make a video showing all of the art in the museum. I was beaten to that very, very quickly. I had some power outage problems, things like that, that slowed me down. So instead, I thought I would make a video showing how to farm art. So it's really far from my house, which is dumb, but this is how I've been farming it. So as you can see down the mini map on the lower right, you can see Red's vehicle is there. You can see that his boat is there. So travel along. I have to use a ladder here. Then the hidden cove for me is behind this cliff. So for the first few times you run into him, he's going to be walking on your island. After that, he will be in the boat. You get into the boat and inside of this boat, you're going to find art and you're going to find items for sale. So I am going to not be doing any checking to see if it's real or fake. You should. You should load up one of the guides showing if it's real or fake. Get yourself a list and keep track of what arts you own. So I'm going to go ahead and buy this sinking painting just because I can to show you how this works. All right. So sinking painting has now been purchased by me. So this is going to be real speed on how you're going to do this. If you hear any banging, it's going to be my little puppy. He's uh, been a little rambunctious this morning. Uh, so we're going to hit save button and wait for it to tell us we're done saving. Okay. So now we can close the software and go down here and just change your date down to up one day. So I went one day forward and make sure you're doing it around. I don't know exactly when red spawn times are. I always just put my clock about 1 p.m. because he doesn't appear later in the day. So make sure you do that. Um, but yeah, while this loading time's going, I was planning on making a video showing the whole museum, but obviously bigger YouTubers used groups and traded. It's going to take you a while to do this solo, which is what I was trying to do. I don't recommend that. I recommend using the guides, checking if it's real or fake now that we have it for all of the arts, because the reels and fakes are different from New Leaf and, uh, maybe do some trading for your extra real paintings you have if you got some duplicates and try to get yourself your collection that way but as you can see we're in the next day originally when I started doing this I was dumb I actually was going each individual day forward and well, I was going till red then I was going to the next week and going each individual day forward until I realized I can just go forward and back maybe it's obvious I, I realized it after like an hour but that first hour was rough. All right, so get through Isabel. You'll get tired of seeing her face while time traveling doing this for sure. All right. Now, probably one already in here, but if I check the mailbox, yes. So here's my last Red's painting. And if I open it, just to show that it is that painting I just got. It is the sinking painting. So if you look, he's not on the map, right? So go ahead and get your paintings if you want and save an end. You could also save without picking it up from the mailbox, but you need to save here. So now you have saved with that painting in your mailbox or inventory. You can now go back, change your date, and just simply go back one day. That was my Discord. Sorry about that. Thought I had that off. They're probably asking why I'm off. Oh, they're asking why I'm not live because I'm supposed to be live on Twitch by now, but my day was delayed. <laughs> All right. I was actually grinding this on stream the other day because of all the loading times. I had plenty of time to play turn-based games. So you can multitask, watch Hulu, Netflix, whatever. So you see we're back. It's raining yet again. Okay. 
So as you can see, I still have that painting in my inventory. I don't know why I'm showing this, just so people are aware. Look on the map and you see red again. So I can do the exact same path. I can do the exact same path I did last time. Of course, if your house is closer and you have easier path to do this, that'll speed this up tremendously. The biggest slowdown is gonna be those loading screens. I hope we eventually get an update that makes it a little faster. Um, here's hoping on that they find a way to speed that up because I do find them pretty slow. This also makes me have a lot of new flowers because it's raining on the day reds here. So I'm also multiplying my flowers while doing this. And when I go in, you'll see that now we have different paintings, different items for sale. And you can go and check, of course, zoom in like this one's fake because of the coffee stain. I'm yet again just going to show that you can buy it and purchase. And that's really all you have to know is just go find red, go forward a day to pick up your painting or artwork, go back a day after you save in the day ahead, red will come back more art. And you can repeat that infinitely until you have either every piece of art or you have enough that you want to sell to others. Thank you for watching. I hope it was useful. I know it's not as useful as those videos showcasing how to have all of the art and detect all the fakes and reels, but there's enough videos and guides out by now that I just don't think I wanted to make that type of content. It's a lot of effort for something that people are going to have in a much nicer edited format already.